Hey everyone, John Hartley. Well, Mike GPO did it to me again. A lot of the my, my recent purchases were because of Mike. Mike GPO, if you don't know me, trades a lot, and uh, with a lot of people in Europe, and he gets some interesting coins that I just find that I have to have. And in his, I think it's his last video, he got another one in that, uh, it's only partially his fault, but I'll get to that in a minute. I'm going to open up this first one just to get it out of the way. This is uh, a couple of eagles to help fill that tube. If you hadn't seen my videos before, um... I cut back on the silver I'm buying lately. I used to get a 10 ounce bar um, every month and I'd fill up a tube of eagles by buying a couple of eagles um, each month. And silver, during this uh, pandemic, it's hard to find a a good price on silver so I've been looking I just couldn't find any so I found the best price I could and then <clears throat> used my eBay books to get me down and I had a pretty good amount of eBay books so I'd make some big purchases lately on uh, eBay so a couple of more 2020 Eagles for this year's tube I think I got eight tubes this might be the eighth now been that's how long I've been stacking silver so uh, silver and stacking as high as quickly as it was but still a pretty good stack. Silver goes up. I can sell it and buy me a new pickup truck. But one of these coins is Mike GPO's fault. This isn't it. This is when I uh <clears throat> when I look at a coin and I find something that I'm going to buy I'll put it into a shopping cart and then I'll go to that sellers other listings and see if he's got anything interesting and uh, possibly save shipping cost and for I think nine dollars he uh, had this one so, pretty nice deal, 1944, 50 centavos, silver, pretty coin. But this is the one, I've been wanting to get a crown for a long time. Uh, I've got some crowns, but modern crowns. I've been wanting one for quite a while, and I, every time I look for one, um, something that's in decent shape and looks good is too expensive. So I found a happy medium. This one is probably AU, and um, it's got a little bit of luster left. Not a lot of bag marks, and uh, you can tell right there on the high spot there's a little bit of wear. But this is 1891 with uh, Victoria's third portrait, and. Um, 
it's a pretty nice coin. So Mike inspired me to go look again. And um, and I did and I found finally found a crown. The crown with this reverse is what I really wanted. And nice hefty. Same size as a silver dollar, of course. That's why I keep flipping that in the wrong way. You know, that's why they call these other coins this size, they call them crown size coins. And uh, our dollar is no different. Our silver dollars. I don't know the exact weight of each one, but I'm sure they're pretty dang close. Nice coin. Not perfect, but nice. <clears throat> Good enough to put in my collection. That's for sure. I noticed that when I pulled out that thing, it had my address sitting there. I'm going to have to blur it out or make a new video. I don't feel like making a new video. So, this week was supposed to be Masters Week. Um, and if you're a golf fan, <clears throat> you know what Masters Week is like. And if you live like I do, within an hour and a half's drive to Augusta, and you get lucky enough to get some tickets, um, it's a it's a great great event. The atmosphere and everything. When you watch the Masters, you don't realize it, but just down the other side of, of the trees is the city of Augusta. The golf tournament is right in the middle of the city. And it's hustle and bustle outside and on the inside of those gates. It's just nice and peaceful and beautiful. All the azaleas blooming this time of year. So with this thing going around, it's not gonna be here. The Masters isn't gonna be played till November. If we're out of this by then, I'm getting kind of tired of this whole illness. I'm not sick. My brother's not sick. My other friends in town aren't sick. Matter of fact, we only have a few cases in our county. And of those cases, only one in my town by my zip code. So, and they estimate that there's under 10 people that are sick in the whole county so um that's one good thing about living in a small town out of the way people on their way from atlanta savannah and charleston and rarely pass through town pass through this town and if they do it's kind of out of the way but if they do it uh nothing here to but a McDonald's and a Hardee's to make them stop and then they probably won't even get out the car so there's just not that many sick people around us which is good which is good hope all of y'all are healthy and well and your families as well and uh, with a little bit of patience we'll get through this thing so I don't have anything else on order right now um I was looking to order some uh, 2019 West Point quarters because I know the price is going to go down on them, but they haven't gone down enough yet for me to buy them. And if you get one, the the ones that people are finding, unless they find it in a roll and you they want too much money for it if you, if it was in a roll and it doesn't have a lot of marks on it. So if you want one that's really nice, you got to get a slabbed one that's in 66 or 67. Some of the 66s are affordable, but just you know I've got two that were found by my brother in um, at work so. 
and but they're the same one. So I'll wait a little longer. Let the price go down a little bit further, see how many more I can find in circulation. So I don't even have any idea. Mike, you need to make a new video. I need some ideas on what to buy next. Well, the silver proof set's coming on sale. But if you're um, if you're planning on buying the silver proof set, they made a hundred and ninety thousand um, proof sets before California ordered all non-essential businesses to close. And unlike Philly and Denver that make circulating uh, coinage, um, San Francisco only makes numismatic coins. So they were deemed to be uh, non-essential and they closed the mint. So if you want that proof set, when it goes on sale at noon, you need to be on the computer or on the phone or you're going to wait a long time to get your coins. So I'm planning on doing that as soon as it goes on sale. What is it, on the 17th or something? I'll be on the computer, logged in, ready to go, throw it in my shopping cart and pay for it. Boom. Same thing I've done on all the ones that sell out quickly, like the uh, 1916 Mercury Gold Dime. Sold out in 21 seconds. I got it. And the, um, the rare reverse proof eagle last year. The computer couldn't handle all, all the demand hitting it. Sorry, I'm not sure about that. It's my Alexa. I called her computer and she talks to me. And um, the reason I call that one computer is because I have two in the kitchen for a stereo effect when I'm in here cooking. I don't know that one. When I'm in here cooking, I can jam to some music with that stereo effect. And they put out some good sound. Kind of neat. So... Until next time, probably the silver proof set, if you would please click on that subscribe nickel in the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. If you give me a thumbs down, tell me what you didn't like about the video other than it's out of focus. Um, <laughs> and please comment. I like reading all your comments and I try to respond to all of them. Until next time, I am 1042.